to be applied when you change legs to the other side and coming back down. If we lift one leg, we're trying to keep the weight of the bottom even on the ball, taking it down, and then when we do it on the other side, again, trying to keep the weight of that bottom even. Hi, I'm Ellen. I'm a Pilates physiotherapist at My Physio SA. Today we're going to be talking about even bottom weight and core stability in our Pilates exercises. So we can start in our crook lie position, so that's knees bent, heels in line with sit bones, energy between the thighs, small curve in the lower back, shoulders relaxed. From here, talking about even bottom weight and core activation, we want to make sure that when we lift our leg, we're not rocking or moving through the pelvis, and especially when we transition from one leg to the other. If we do that without our core stability, as we lift one leg, we see the pelvis rock or tip, we can see that on the other leg as well. So a good way to practice this is by putting your hands underneath your bottom. Think of it as two little kitchen scales. Breathing in. As we breathe out, using our diaphragm to help support our core, gently lifting that pelvic floor as we lift one leg, creating more stability. And you should feel even weight through your bottom onto each hand. That even weight should also be applied when you change legs to the other side and coming back down. So the same concept of even bottom weight can be applied to a ball. So when we take one foot off of the ground, we don't want to shift our weight onto one side. You'll feel the whole ball move. So again, if we can use our core in this example, we're going to breathe out using our side breathing. And as we lift one leg, we're trying to keep the weight of the bottom even on the ball, taking it down. And then when we do it on the other side, Again, trying to keep the weight of that bottom even and coming down. Thank you for watching another one of our Pilates videos. It's really important that you're not feeling any pain or discomfort when doing these exercises. If you have any questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to contact us.